The age old question, amber versus clear, does it make a difference? Does color temperature really matter? Let's find out. Uh, today we're gonna talk about some amber versus clear. Uh, a lot of people know that it's great for dust, snow, and fog, but not everyone knows why. So we'd like to clarify some of those points for you. Color temperature. Uh, we're gonna be talking about the Kelvin scale, one to 12,000 K Kelvin. Um, what we're gonna have is if you have lower on the scale, you're gonna have your red, your orange, and your yellow hues. On the upper end, where we're gonna have colder light, is gonna be blue indigo to violet. Um, on the upper end, it is actually more difficult for the human eye to process and have a sharper defined image. What that causes is basically a blue light fatigue. And you may have noticed a number of products in, in different optical spaces that reduce that fatigue by eliminating the blue rays of light. Now that's gonna be the mechanism that allows amber to actually have its performance gains in certain situations. Amber can be achieved in a number of ways. Um, in the past, there have been LEDs and bulbs. The reality is, is that the output is just not there and you get a lot more performance by just pairing it with a amber colored lens. Fun fact, our lights actually aren't amber. We use it as a generic trade term. We use selective yellow based on years of experience in racing. Um, there's a, a reduced amount of lumen loss when it comes to selective yellow, which is why we chose that. Um, and it's gonna be registering more on like 3000 color temperature scale. A nice thing about Baja Design's U-Service program is that we can actually change out the lens and you don't have to buy an entire light to achieve an amber color. The one drawback with amber lights is it does cut down on your output approximately 15%. Um, but in most cases, this is not a problem because you want to reduce the intensity to be able to see in that inclement weather environment anyway. The human eye has evolved to see best at a 5000K color temperature, which is most similar to noon on a sunny day. A lot of our competitors' offerings will be 6000 to 6500K color temperature, and this will cause a lot more fatigue on the long-term endurance races and outings. For this reason, Baja Designs exclusively uses 5000K color temperature LEDs across all of our products. Common misconception, most people think the amber lights actually prevent this splashback from light reflecting back off of particles in the air, whether it be dust, snow, or fog, but it's actually in your eyes. You have less optical workload needed to register and define what's in your environment. Um, when you have less blue light in that environment. Well, actually, it doesn't really matter clear or amber. If you have too much intensity in your environment, you're gonna have a perceived glare no matter what. So that's where you wanna be dimming your lights or have some type of high-low function. Subjectively speaking, we've had a ton of great feedback from our athletes and professional drivers alike of the benefits of amber lights. Generally speaking, it helps a lot with terrain recognition and contrasting the environment to be able to make out you know, dips and holes and boulders and all kinds of things you wanna look out for. We're looking at an XL Sport in the wide cornering pattern. Clear's gonna throw further, but in certain situations, your eyes might perceive that the light is spilling back at you and make it harder to register your environment. This is our Amber XL Sport in the wide cornering pattern. As you can see, it's a much more pleasant viewing experience and this can help a ton in dust, snow, and fog. What's best, amber or clear? Well, the reality is it all depends on your application. Are you gonna be driving high speed open desert? A clear and intense light is gonna be the best option. Are you gonna be navigating through some inclement weather situations? You're gonna want amber lights on a dimmer or with a high-low function. Overall, we believe the best is a mix of both for an all-around great performing light package. The nice thing about U-Service is that you can always tune your package with different lens overlays as well as amber or clear. 
Well, that's that. Amber versus Clear. We hope you enjoyed the video. Please like or comment, subscribe. Visit us at BajaDesigns.com. Come check out our new building. Come say hi. We'd love to have you. Thank you for watching, and we hope to see you again soon.